Sometimes, the most incredible discoveries happen when you least expect them. A team of deep-sea explorers was going about a routine mission, charting the unknown depths of the ocean. They thought it would be just another day of mapping underwater mountains and canyons, but then their remote camera spotted something that made everyone on the ship fall silent. It was a perfect golden sphere shining in the darkness, a complete mystery resting on the ocean floor. The scene unfolded in the vast cold waters of the Gulf of Alaska. A research vessel from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, better known as NOAA, was methodically at work. The ship, the Okeanos Explorer, is America's premier vessel for ocean exploration, a floating laboratory designed to peek into the darkest corners of our planet. Its main tool is a remotely operated vehicle, or ROV, which is essentially a robotic submarine that acts as the scientists' eyes and hands thousands of feet below the surface. On this particular day, the ROV was exploring at a staggering depth of 3,300 meters, or about two miles down. Here, the pressure is immense, over 300 times what we experience on land, and the environment is one of total, permanent darkness, broken only by the powerful lights of the machine. The team was live-streaming the footage, with scientists from all over the world tuning in when the object appeared. There it was, nestled on a rocky ledge among a field of pale white sponges. It was a small dome, measuring about 10 centimeters, or 4 inches, across. Its surface was incredibly smooth, and it glowed with a distinct golden color, almost as if it were made of metal. But what truly baffled the observers was a small torn hole near its base. It looked like something had tried to get in, or perhaps get out. The control room buzzed with confused and excited chatter. The live stream captured their genuine bewilderment. One scientist commented that it looked like the beginning of a horror movie. Another joked that they shouldn't poke it, just in case something decided to emerge. It was clear that none of these experts had ever seen anything like it. Instantly, the speculation began. The most tantalizing theory was that this was an egg casing. But if so, what kind of creature could have produced it? Nothing in the known biological record fits the description. Deep-sea sharks lay tough, leathery egg cases, often in spiral or screw-like shapes. Fish and squid typically lay soft, gelatinous eggs. This object was firm, smooth, and had a unique skin-like texture. If it is an egg, it belongs to an organism that is completely unknown to science. The very idea that some mysterious deep-sea mother left its golden progeny on a rock two miles beneath the waves is the stuff of exploration dreams. The tear near the base only added to the drama. Had the creature already hatched, or had a predator tried to break through? Another, more grounded possibility is that the object isn't an egg at all, but a very strange form of life itself. The deep ocean is famous for its bizarre organisms. There are glass sponges that build complex skeletons out of silica, looking like intricate glass sculptures. Perhaps this golden sphere is a new type of sponge or tunicate, which has developed a unique protective outer layer. The hole could be its way of filtering food particles from the water, However, when the team finally managed to get the object on board the ship, its texture was described as being as delicate as silk. This organic, soft feel makes the sponge theory less likely, as they usually have a more fibrous or porous structure. The sheer strangeness of the object left all the simple explanations feeling inadequate. Of course, the only way to solve the puzzle was to bring the specimen to the surface. This was a mission in itself, the robotic arm of the ROV had to be handled with extreme care. Using a gentle suction tool, the operator delicately detached the sphere from the rock and placed it into a secure collection box. The ascent from such a tremendous depth took hours, a slow and careful journey to prevent any damage from the drastic change in pressure. The entire team waited with anticipation, wondering if the object would look the same in the open air and bright lights of the ship's lab. Once on deck, the mystery only deepened. The golden orb was just as striking as it had been on the video feed. It was surprisingly light, and its texture was indeed soft and biological. 
It was clearly not a rock or a piece of metal. It was organic, but what kind of organism? The initial examination on the ship provided no answers. The truth, everyone knew, was hidden within its DNA. The sample was carefully preserved and prepared for transport to a specialized laboratory on land. There, scientists will perform a genetic analysis. They will try to extract DNA from the tissue in compared sequence to a massive database of all known life on Earth. This process is like a grand-scale paternity test for nature. It will tell them if this object is related to a fish, a coral, a sponge, or, in the most exciting scenario, if it belongs to a completely new branch on the tree of life, something fundamentally different from anything we've cataloged before. This discovery is so much more than just a single strange object. It is a powerful symbol of how little we know about our own planet. We have mapped the entire surface of the Moon and Mars in high resolution, yet over 80% of Earth's oceans remain a complete mystery. Depths like the ones explored by the Okeanos Explorer are less understood than distant planets. We simply do not know what is down there. Each expedition into this dark world is a journey into the unknown, with the potential to rewrite our understanding of biology, chemistry, and life itself. The Gulf of Alaska, where the sphere was found, is proving to be a treasure trove of biodiversity, with new species of corals and other organisms being identified on this very same mission. So the golden orb from the deep now sits in a lab, holding its secrets close. Is it the cradle for a new form of life? A bizarre deep-sea organism's home? Or something else entirely? For now, we are left to wonder and wait for the results of the DNA tests. This single, beautiful, and baffling object is a humble reminder that our world is still full of genuine wonder and profound mysteries. The deep ocean has offered up a clue, a single golden thread, and scientists are now pulling on it to see what secrets it might unravel.